Welcome back everyone, Al here, making stuff and breaking stuff. So today, we're going to do an unboxing of the Makita Jobsite Bluetooth Radio. Now this is part of the LXT uh, set, the all black subcompact line. I saw this radio, I checked it out in the store and I just loved it. So I picked it up, we're going to unbox it, crank her up, see how she works. Alright, let's unbox this bad mamma jamma and see what's inside of it. Instruction pack. We well, actually might have to read that one. And then the unit itself. That's it. Pretty easy box. I think all the stuff is actually inside of it. So what I thought was really cool in the store was that um, the way this opens up. Check this out. So you have this handle here in the back. Pops up like that. Boom. Oh, the goodies. This must be the adapter. See, that's the only thing I don't like about some of these job site radios. They come with a stupid AC adapter. But I'm primarily going to run it off a of battery. So let's plug in the battery and see how she sounds. You guys are wondering what this uh, fancy little bracelet I'm wearing. That's because we just had the baby on Monday. She's born at 10, 13 a.m. Just under 7 pounds, right around 20 inches. Healthy baby girl. Beautiful little baby girl. It does have this nice uh, waterproof gasket. Now, I have not messed with this yet, so bear with me here. Is that blinking blue? Hmm, hold on. All right, power on. Well, it lists the numbers, everything, but where's the number list? Oh, so battery compartment, mobile cell phone compartment, play pause button. Eleven is the power button. Okay, so where's the power button? All right, so the speaker, it's it's very cool. I mean, I like it, but I was under the wrong impression when I bought this. I thought this was a radio, like a, a old school boombox radio, AM, FM, antenna. You know, then you can hook up Bluetooth or plug in your device. You can't do that on this. This is just a Bluetooth speaker. So there's no digital uh, readout on here at all. There's no AM, FM, it's just hook up your Bluetooth, volume up, down, pause, and that's it. I mean, for that aspect of it, it's very cool. It's lightweight, it sounds pretty good. You know you have your cord here, your aux, and then USB. Another thing, it does not charge the batteries, which is a little disappointing. I don't know why it's so hard to make a damn radio that charges the batteries. My Ryobi one was freaking great, the thing always charged the batteries. I'm going to take that off because I'll lose my uh, USB signal here. But, I mean, that's cool. I mean, it has phone storage on the back. I mean, it looks sharp. I just love this blackout style Makita has. I don't know. I really like listening to the radio in the garage. So I was hoping it had an AM, FM feature on it. And I don't think it charges either. See, the only thing it says is Bluetooth speaker lasts up to 32 hours. Um... Water and dust resistant. Construction is engineered for improved operation in harsh job site conditions. Auxiliary ports for MP3, blah, 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 jack adapter, blah, blah, blah. Fairly interesting that it accepts all the different uh, batteries. I do like that. It's light. I mean, it's compact. I do like that a lot. So overall, I mean, I would give it a consumer thumbs up. I mean, it's very rugged. It has this good, you can't really tell from the 
just looking at it, but it has this really grippy rubber grip on it. The same along the edges here. Looks like it's very well protected on the corners. This is just hard plastic here. Again, it seals all the ports up so it's dust and water resistant. Nice speaker. It says there's a subwoofer in there, so. You can see what's in there. So I see a tweeter there. It looks like I'm, okay, so you got the big, big range here, and they have a little tweet here. It says there's a subwoofer. I don't know if they consider that. Four inch speaker inside there, a subwoofer. It looks like, so you got the tweet and mid, I don't know. Turn it on here and see what it sounds like. Can't play it too long because it'll get uh, copyrighted. But that was full volume. What I do? So not amazing. I mean, this little speaker I got here, the Sylvania, I got last year on Black Friday for five bucks. Bluetooth, um, rechargeable. You can answer the phone through it. This is five dollars. You know what I mean? This I'm paying for the name. That's why it was hard for to justify to buy this. When this, I have, this, I have two of these, it does the exact same thing this does, and this is five dollars. This is ninety-nine bucks. I mean, you know how many of those these I could get for for this price? I mean, it has an internal rechargeable lithium battery too. So, I don't know. It's definitely cool. I like it. I just wish it was $39.99 instead of $99.99. So, you have one consumer thumb up, not two. Sounds okay. Good grip. I mean, the operation is pretty simple. I do like the way the battery seals. I like it, the way it looks a lot. I just wish it had AM, FM radio on it. That's all I, I really wanted. Hope you like the review okay. of the Makita cordless job site speaker, not radio. That's why I only have one thumb up because I thought I had AM, FM, and it does not. Uh, this is model XRM08B as in boy. Bluetooth job site radio. It does, is compatible with all the different heat of batteries. 18 volt, 14 volt, or the 12 volt go there. Waterproof, dustproof, weighs 7.2 pounds with the battery in it. Not bad, I think it's a little pricey. If it's 40 bucks, I'd use this all day long, but not for 100. All right guys, if there's anything you want me to review, please leave it in the comments and let me know. I'll be more than happy to try to pick it up and do a review, whether if you want me to go in depth, do different tests with it, cutting tests, drilling tests, you know, whatever you want me to do, I'll be more than happy to try it. Um, so give me some ideas guys, come on. And uh, this video should be out here tonight or tomorrow, so happy Thanksgiving, baby came on Monday. Uh, her and mom are coming home today, Wednesday. They're both doing very good. I might even pop her into the next video so you guys can take a peek at her. Um, what else? Thank you everyone for the new subscribers. Appreciate the support. Don't forget, smash that like button. Subscribe, because come on, dude. You want to see what I got coming out. Subscribe to me. All right, everyone. Thanks for watching. See ya.